Well, we just got, uh, we just loaded up with 40,000 pounds of tires. We're going to take it to Flagstaff to the HMS Machinery. We are in Las Vegas right now. We're driving to the Freightliner Cascadia. We got the uh, quad axle reefer on with the steer axle. Put the long load sign on the back. And... Let's go and see what happens. We're on the multiplayer, so this could be interesting, I guess. There's a few people on. But anyway, let's go and see what happens. A little short run. Um, snowing. I don't have the physics mod on for the frosty wind weather. I, uh, I don't really like it all that much, to tell you the truth. Um, if I wanted to use it, I'd just turn my brake settings down to, uh, all the way down. And it'd basically be the same thing. So, let's get this shit off the screen. <laughs> get us a blinker on. And go down the road and see what happens. Let's see what kind of trouble we can get into. Do you see I got my little hope trucker and delivered uh I think I delivered all together it's uh twelve or thirteen loads of vaccine for the COVID nineteen. I got that little uh, medallion thing there hanging down and um, a paint skin, which I don't think I've looked at yet. St. George, Utah, if you guys want to come over here to the left side where the Walmart's at, left side of the uh, Las Vegas street. We roll it out. Always oh, stop the red lights. I don't know. It just feels wrong to run them. <laughs> Even when there's nobody around, I still stop. I mean, if other people want to run them, as long as there's not anybody else around, I don't see a problem with it. But don't you go flying through there if there's like people waiting and shit. I mean. You have an accident, it's going to be your fault for in the red light, so... It'll all be on you. Get kicked and banned for that. Just a little bit of advice. Alright, I don't see anything in the next lane there, so we're just going to go ahead and... Uh, move over, I think. Yep. And we're going to take this exit here. 42B. Now we got to go on the other side of Flagstaff. On down past Flagstaff, so keep that in mind. As far as the speed goes with the winter weather on, um, I drive faster than what I would in real life. If, I, if this was real life, I'd probably be doing like 45, 55, maybe, if that. But everybody else is still doing 70 and 80 in the game, so I, I like to keep it around between 65 and 75.
Mm, let's see how long this run's actually going to be. Mm. That's three hours, and it's going to take probably about five minutes to get there. Go ahead and get in this other lane because that one splits off. And we want to keep going. I'm using winter weather mod because if I don't use it, it still snows and then the ground, it just looks like it's just snow falling from the sky because that's the way they got the server set. Um, and it doesn't land on the windshield or anything, so I figured, well, if it's going to snow, I might as well just throw the mod on and have it show snow. And that's what the little round white dots you'll see in still the streaks. The little round white dots is the server snow. Kind of hard to see, but they are there. And then this thing gets it, I forgot how fast it's this thing picks up speed. Gets an Allison seven speed automatic or automated, whatever you want to call it. We'll just go ahead and hit the cruise control. Real life, we wouldn't be using the cruise control in winter weather. That's a big no-no. Very, very dangerous. Yes. My bad, dude. I wasn't even paying attention. We got better internet, but the upload still the same. It still sucks ass. So, so we can figure out a way to fix that. Which I think we're just going to wait and, until they do something with the towers. If we don't have regular internet here, we've got to use uh, T-Mobile Hotspot uh, 5G is what it ended up with. It's over 50 megs a second, so the upload is just, I don't know, it's slow, it's shit. Before, we uh, was using uh, T-Mobile, just regular T-Mobile, uh, the 4G, which had decent upload. Well, kind of. It's between two and three megs. Second, isn't much, but for uh, out in the middle of nowhere, it's pretty good. Way station one mile. Follow in cab signal. We pass side all trucks to the right lane. Wait station a half mile. We're going to stop, aren't we? Yep. And so we'll just go ahead and slow it down some more here, so. Which kind of limits to what I can upload and how much. Because when I'm uploading there, it just kills it. Nobody else can use the internet. Mm -hmm. um, 
not uploading as much as I'd like to, but I want to try to maintain at least one video a week. I like to do one every other day or every day, but that's quite a bit. We'll see how it goes. Be number 35. 35. Let's go ahead and get in this other lane over here because we're going to have to make a left hand turn. I believe this is 40. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, it looks like this is 40. Forty west, uh, ninety three north, oh south, ninety three south. One way street, no right turns, thirty five speed limit. Other lights turning to red, SARS is green. Yep, yep. There goes two buddies. Believe it or not, I have not participated in a convoy yet on multiplayer. Which I need to do, just to try it out and see what it's like. I just don't want to get in the one and then there'd be some you know, jackass screwing everything up, running into people and shit just because he can. I'm going to check our mirrors to make sure we're still good. Man, those other two must have been flying. They are gone. Speed limit is 75 twos. I don't understand the people that come on here and just, you know, just go all out, flat out, 80 miles an hour, 99% of the time, running in red lights and blowing through stop signs and all that. I just don't understand, you know, thing behind that, but I guess I like to keep it kind of realistic. Stop and build a snowman in the middle of the interstate. Unless somebody ran into it and totaled their car. Be funny as hell to watch. 4,000 feet. We must be getting close. I'm seeing trees. One bad thing about this transmission it just does not do good on heels look we got the ISX coming in here 630 horsepower I believe pretty sure I don't remember much as I play you'd think I know but I didn't know 
never really uh, paid that much attention to it, really. been working on getting footage for like crashes and people doing stupid stuff in the game I'll make a compilation out of it um, I think I just about got enough footage to uh, make a little compilation stupid stuff like wrecks and people acting retarded and dude took four hours trying to bank it in and Like that. Which I think it'll turn out pretty good once I get it all edited. Don't see nothing coming. HMS is gonna be us right here. Back, back, back it up, driver. Oh no. There's shit everywhere. Rolling. Put the brake on. You really gonna want it. Yeah, that, well, I guess we're putting it there. I accidentally double clicked on it, so. Um, I think we could blind it in there. It. Oh, the wrong button. Uh, make sure we're clear. Yeah, the fence. Fucking button on my joystick's wearing out, so it goes like it zooms in and out, unless you push it really hard. Bugs this shit out of me. Okay, I'm gonna cut it this way. And then... We're going to... Get out and look. What have we done? We screwed it all up too far. Okay. All right, back the other way. Back it up. Back, 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 back it up. Uh huh. Okay. I think we can uh, get it right around there. Where's the other trailer at? Over there. Hit another stick. Is that gonna clear that? It doesn't look like it. Let's get out and look. No, we're not. I didn't think we was going to. Okay. We'll do this and let's pull this up here. Cut it all the way that way. Okay. Start getting it back under. We should have it cleared now. Now we just gotta straighten it up. All the way back. Back it up. In reverse to back up. Yeah, we got it cleared now. Get out and look again. Oh, ain't nothing wrong with getting out and looking. Alright, we're looking good. Should be able to just uh, pivot that right up in there. Got it cranked all the way. We're going too far. Maybe not. No, we ain't. We're right on. We're right where we need to be. Go ahead and start straightening it out here. Go honk in the horn. Oh damn, we're awful close to that other trailer. Back to the way. Oh, get out of look. So I need to go straight forward all the way. Straight forward. That'll straighten it out. Alright. 
then we can back crank it all the way to the left and back it up what the hell is that in the corner back there an owl We've, we've screwed this all up. Alright, we could be saved. Wait until it stops. All the way back, all the way back. Go. Okay, cut it to the left. All the way to the left, uh, go straight forward, all the way to the right, line it just straight up, straight forward and backwards. Well, we're over a little bit too far, but we can make that work. See, in our dock, it's garage door, so it doesn't have to be perfect. There we go. We got her in there. Took a minute. We didn't hit nothing. It's all still in one piece, so that's the main thing. 221 miles, 2 hours, 21 minutes, 49.2 gallons of fuel. We got $13,231 out of that. 411 XP. That's just a little short video. I hope you enjoyed it still. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and leave a comment, and we'll see you in the next video.